Well, I'm excited about returning back home to Los Angeles. That's where I first got my start. And I think there's a lot of things you can do at the local level and really see immediate change and impact the lives of so many people. So I'm really excited about getting back home. It's a general area that I represented in the House and also in the State Senate. So there's a lot of familiarity there. But now I bring the scope and, and the experience that I gained working at the federal level. Well, the hard uh, economic situation, the downturn in unemploy you know, unemployment, the rates going way high, um, and just getting people back to work and creating a safety net for them. So while people were receiving, for example, unemployment insurance, our task was also to provide them with training and other skills that they needed so they could readily jump back into the workforce. I think um, one of the moments that I really think uh, was very special was when we were able to put uh, investments and funding into renewable energy and green jobs. Jobs, and that was something that was kind of a hallmark for this administration. It is important because they are the uh, largest ethnic minority group now. They're 50 million and more strong, and they're electing officials. And I can foresee their involvement in our society at all levels of government. You see it now. Our numbers need to increase, but we also need to have opportunities to be able to grow in different sectors across our economy, across society, and also be encouraged to get involved in politics and civic participation. That's why it's necessary to push for immigration reform so that people can uh, become more stabilized, be able to really put their, you know, put their anchors or their hooks down here and really create a, a more robust environment economically as well as intellectually. So I think it's, it's very important that we keep our eye on that particular issue in the next coming months and, the, and in the next year.